We're resetting today. The balloons are being blown up and it is madness. And at this moment, I wanna say thank you. I hope you all have at least one friend, like We're resetting today. heating up the soup I got ramen for dinner and it took like an hour for them to deliver it like 45 minutes ago I got a text that the order was on the way this restaurant is like less than 10 minutes away but it's finally here really making a Sunday night ramen a thing pretty much every Sunday that I've been home for the past like month and a half ramen has been the go-to meal it has been a very lazy Sunday today. After I got my vlog up this morning, or not vlog, after I got my half marathon video up this morning, I kind of just was a couch potato. But you know, some days, sometimes you just need a lazy Sunday. And it was very nice. It's good. Still too cold though. Now we got some steam coming off of that. Taste test, take two. Mm-hmm. 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 Very good. Where did I order from? This is a new place I haven't tried yet. Called Zaruto, Upper West Side. It's on, like, I think 72nd. Yeah. It's on West 72nd. Zaruto Ramen. Not bad. $15 for their, like, classic ramen. Pretty good not too shabby I had fully planned to like deep clean my entire apartment today will that happen I feel like no because I'm gonna eat this and lay down on the couch <laughs> and not want to move again but I at least have done all of my laundry I had so much laundry well there's still some in the dryer but so I have to fold laundry later but it could be worse I really need to like clean my floors and like move things and like clean in like the nooks and crannies but now it's dark out and I just don't want to <laughs> it's only 5 30 but I'm like mm, I just want to lay on my couch and watch a movie maybe I will do that I hope that if you guys are watching this next Sunday when it goes up you're enjoying a relaxing Sunday yourself I know I will not be relaxing next Sunday because next Sunday is the day before my birthday. So I'm going out Saturday night and doing a brunch on Sunday. So relax for me because I'll probably need it after my weekend next week. So I tried something new and I ordered my groceries through Instacart from Wegmans in Brooklyn. 
I don't know why. Okay, no, I do know why I don't normally use like delivery service because like Trader Joe's is just so cheap. Like I spent, I think around eighty dollars on all this, which I did buy a good amount. But, like Trader Joe's is so cheap, but it was like so cold, and I was a little bit hungover today, and just like did not want to go grocery shopping because it's also gonna be a madhouse because it's the Sunday before Thanksgiving. So. I decided to try it out. So let's see how they did. Time for a Wegmans Instacart grocery haul. Bananas, grapes, hummus, some mini cukes, baby carrots, Wegmans brand peanut butter, three gala apples, baby spinach, some clementines, cause I've just been feeling the citrus lately. One red onion, celery, eggs, two cans of chicken and wild rice soup, two cans of chicken noodle soup, Peruvian style pre-marinated chicken. Not one, but two Annie's mac and cheeses. This is the one thing with it being through Instacart, I don't have a receipt to scan for Fetch Rewards. That's a bummer right there, but this was still cool. Okay, let's see. Total for all of this. Came to $85.46. And that includes, I have free delivery right now because I'm in like a two week free trial. So that $85 includes the tip and includes the like service fee. So definitely a little bit more expensive, but like the convenience and the fact that I didn't have to go do this and I was able to like be here and do other things, it's a great use of time. And that's what we like to see. Honestly, I feel like that's some like boss bitch energy right there. Just saying. Now, it's time to be a couch potato and do nothing the rest of the night. Peace. <laughs> Hello, friends. Happy Monday. Um, this is my lunch right now. Cucumber and hummus, because I have to walk Zoe in like two minutes. Four minutes, actually. We got all the time. I'm having a wonderful Monday. Worked out this morning, was at work doing some like admin stuff, coached the 1215 class and there was so much energy in the room. It was also like a full 1215 class because like half of it was filled with employees. So it was just like great energy. My manager and like another, like a couple other higher ups were in the class and I just felt like I was rocking it. And just, it's just a great Monday. I feel like yesterday was such a good like reset chill day and like I'm ready to take on this week. <sighs> Zoe. 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 <laughs> Does not care. She's just happy to be outside. But how cute is she in her little coat? That's like the best part about winter. Not the people fashion. It's the dog fashion. And they're setting something up here at Lincoln Center. They've been working on it since last week. And I have no idea what it is. I think it might be like, I thought it was gonna be like a snow globe, but now I really have no clue. It's sunset walk o'clock. Absolutely gorgeous. And look at it on the buildings. Stunning. Like, come on. How beautiful out the buildings. Oh, so pretty. So pretty. I love this city. Good morning. There is something about being the first one to show up to work in the morning. That is so nice. I just made some coffee. And we're just relaxing a little bit because I got here early. So I still have a few minutes until I need to start getting the room ready. But we got a nice short three classes, three mid-morning classes. It's almost 8 a.m. since it's the day before Thanksgiving. And we're gonna have a fun, a fun day. This is insane. Little news chopper up there. Nothing. 
the balloons are being blown up and it is madness. I think it took us like an hour to get here. It's just a little bit before five. <laughs> Someone's about to talk. People are saying the mayor. Oh, 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 is it? <laughs> We've made it around to the second side and they this is where they're still blowing them up a little bit. Pretty cool. Only you can prevent a forest fire. Well, that was an experience. Ooh. Took an hour total to get through the line and see the balloons. And now we're at the floats. This girl, right? Oh, where'd she go? Where'd she go? I'll find her. Right there. Right there. I went to high school with her. Her name's Mariah. <laughs> so cool. Happy Thanksgiving! Christiana is over, and we are watching the parade on the TV. Because last year, we had our parents here, and my mom and our aunt were like all set to be there at like five in the morning and stake out a spot like right on the barricaded part. And you know, we just didn't have it in us this year. And it's more fun with a big group. So we decided we're gonna have a relaxing morning at home. We're gonna make some yummy breakfast and relax and chill and just watch the parade from the comfort of my home. The best part. Ready? I went to high school with her, that's Shelby. <laughs> Just flexing on all the people that I went to high school with who are now performing in life. And I'm here. <laughs> yummy. Wanna be the papa you can read more. Oh oh. Why Sean Paul is on in the parade right now, I do not know, but I'm vibing. I'm here for it. We got cinnamon rolls, we got bacon, and we're making eggs! <laughs> Christiana. <laughs> It is 1 p.m. and yes, I am still in my pajamas. We uh, finished the parade and then I needed to kind of like clean my apartment because I <laughs> have not done that. Sunday I wanted to, didn't. It's Thursday, we finally did it. And now it's time to start drinking. And we got these from um, the grocery store last night, Sun Boy. It is a spiked coconut water. And we tried it in the store. They had three different flavors. They had tangerine, passion fruit, and pineapple. The pineapple tasted similar to like a pina colada. The passion fruit was just like, tasted like passion fruit. But the tangerine, oh. pause for the sirens. My life always. So adorable. We're watching the dog show now that the parade is over. But, okay, so the tangerine tastes like a mimosa. So we were like, um, we're getting that one for the morning. Now that it's now that one it's one. I know, <laughs> for the morning, now that it's one. It's brunch time. Yeah. We had breakfast and now we're drinking. Cheers. Cheers. It's 
good. I'm not always a huge fan of coconut water, but, but it's nice. It doesn't taste like coconut water. No added sugar, hydrating coconut water, benefits of real fruit. Her selling factor was that basically it's like you get the like spiked drink, but it's coconut water, so it's like a little bit more hydrating than dehydrating with like a regular like spiked, spiked beverage. Mm -hmm. And it still is like it's like a little carbonated, but not like a ton. Gluten free. She said that they were local too. Yeah, she did say they're local. At Drink Sunny Boy oh. is their Instagram or drinksunnyboy.com is their website. But yeah, it doesn't say where they are. She did say it was local though. It was Drink Sunny Boy? Flip before you sip. Oops. Drink Sun Boy, not Sunny Boy. At Sun. Drink Why am I saying Sun Sunny Boy? boy? <laughs> sunny, sunny Boy? boy. <laughs> it's because I was just watching Shit's Creek oh. in the episode where um, Moira sings Danny Boy. Oh. <laughs> Oh, Danny boy. boy. The pipes. The, the pipes are calling. <laughs> Sun boy. Go get yourself some if you can. It's really good. Okay, it's time to find the best in show. Tonight, the national dog show best in show winner is the French Bulldog. Oh, ah! oh my god. That's so cute. Oh, that's so adorable. Look at him. Oh, the owner's so happy. He's like, oh, look at that little face. Ah, he's so cute. So cute. So cute. Ah, what a wonderful Thanksgiving morning slash afternoon it's been. We have some little chickens in the oven. Joy is on her way over and uh, the Thanksgiving festivities. Well, they've been going all day, but they're going to continue. Dinner time, Friendsgiving. Brody, where'd you go? Brody! <laughs> He's so cute. This is Thanksgiving right now. Going on a little evening stroll and we are on my favorite street and someone's playing some music. We got the, the bike cart over there. This street's the best. It is not that often that you can just stand in a street in New York City. So we're taking advantage. And at this moment, I wanna say thank you. I appreciate you all so much. And I'm so, so very grateful to have all of you wonderful subscribers in my life and to be able to share this wonderful city with you. Vlogging this. Look at Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. Joy, you're so cute. You're part of the circus. I am. I'm <laughs> we're, walk circus. we're walking over by the Big Apple. And there's a show going on. <laughs> it's another floor dinner. Hey friends, um, it's Saturday and it is the start of my birthday celebration weekend. It's, um, let's see what time is it? It's 6.30. I'm having dinner, which is leftover Thanksgiving chicken and some green beans. And then I have to get ready to go out. I'm excited to go out. A little bit bummed that like people are like starting to cancel, which I fully expect it to happen. I know there's like a few people that are for sure coming, so it'll be a fun time, like I'm not worried about that, but I am a little bit bummed that people are like, yeah, I don't know, but like it's all for valid reasons, like I totally understand, but you know, like it's my birthday and like 
I want everyone to be there to celebrate with me. But most of the people who will not be coming tonight will be at brunch tomorrow. So that's why I did two things, to give people the option, also to like ensure that I was able to celebrate with all the people that I love. After I eat, I'm trying to decide if I do um, like a get ready TikTok. I already know what I'm wearing. I picked out my outfit earlier and I'm very excited about it. I think it's cute, so. Trust the process. <laughs> the hair is curled. Um, it needs to like settle a bit and we'll run our fingers through like before we go. But it's time to pop some champagne and nobody's here yet because I think the only people who are gonna be here are Christiana and my friend Audrey who, when I tell you, Audrey is like the realest friend ever. She is driving from Washington DC just to come out with me tonight to celebrate my birthday and then is driving back at like six in the morning. That's an amazing friend. That, that right there, she's a real one. I hope you all have at least one friend like Audrey. And with that, let's pop some champagne or Prosecco since it's not technically champagne. <laughs> Woo! My favorite, Mionetti Prosecco. Let's drink. So good. I figured since my hair was done, now all I have to do is makeup, which takes like five minutes, and then put my outfit on, which the top is right here. And it's actually a dress, <laughs> but <laughs> we're not wearing it as a dress. <laughs> I'll show you later. We are ready. Audrey has arrived. Christiana's here. Let's, let's give it a little fit check. Okay, back up, back up, back up over here, over here. Yay! Oh. All right, now we have to go because our lift is like two minutes away. See you at the club.